Hello friends, uh, I'm Parwis and this is our sixth video in Unity uh, in Unity 5 game development and C Sharp scripting. Uh, in the last video we have uh, made a cloudy sky box uh, like this. Uh, let me run and uh, this was from the fifth video. And you can see we have a uh, cloudy sky box. Uh, and I have added a carton car and uh, movement script, rotation script to this. <coughs> okay. Now in this video, uh, in this video we want to uh, make a flying object. We want to uh, make a flying object. Okay. Now let's get started. First of all, we should uh, make a new scene. Scene. Uh, control N. Now from here, uh, from game object, 3D object, uh, make a cube. Uh, like this okay let me uh, uh, from the main camera uh, I remove the sky box uh, to the solid color and change this to uh, uh, like this black okay uh, let me bring it in here like this okay now uh, just make it 0 0 and 0 <coughs> okay uh, now we want to make a new C sharp script just uh, uh, right click and uh, create C sharp script make it flying call it flying now open this okay the first thing you need some public uh, variables you need the first one is uh, public float uh, we give a horizontal speed horizontal speed and uh, give it 0 0.08 float okay now we need a public float vertical speed vertical speed and give it to 2 to float to F and uh, we need a public float uh, I name it height uh, mm, I give it height okay and it should be 2 float these are public uh, variable you can change this in the unit engine okay and uh, Oh, we need one another variable uh, vector three, 3 public vector for our positions vector 3 uh, temp position position ok now in the start uh, uh, take your temp position and uh, make it transform dot position uh, we take our uh, transform position from this section uh, if I choose this from this transform and save it in our temp position ok now in make this fix, fixed update uh, fixed update ok now in here uh, we take our temp position dot x and uh, plus it with uh, horizontal speed and also we take our temp position dot y and make it to mat matif dot sign time uh, dot uh, real time real-time startup 
and multiply this by vertical speed and multiply it by height okay now uh, transform dot position and make it to 10 position equal it to 10 position like this okay uh, this was our code uh, we made some public variables uh, horizontal speed vertical speed height uh, we take our transform dot position and uh, store it in 10 position after that we take our 10 position dot x uh, plus it by horizontal speed after that we uh, take our y position and uh, uh, take our matter dot sign and uh, multiply it by vertical speed and multiply it by height okay now this is our code. Open your unit engine and uh, choose, uh, select your cube, add this uh, flying to your object. You can see that we have horizontal speed, uh, vertical speed, height. You can change this, and also we have a temp position. Okay. If I run this, mm, it's not working. Uh, flying script. Uh, let me check it. Uh, public horizontal speed, uh, vertical height, uh, and temp position, uh, temp position dot x. Uh, multiply it by height. Uh, temp position. Okay. Uh, let me. Um, okay, um, I should save this. Now, if I run this, you can see that we have a uh, flying object, but uh, I think the speed is uh, if I make it 1. Uh, now, if I run this. or change this to 0 0.02 you can see that we have a, a flying object uh, okay uh, thank you guys if you have any question please let me know and I will add the source code in the description and for the further videos please subscribe my channel